Hello everyone and welcome back to Country Cast. Today we are going to share a really beautiful and just awesome story surrounding Toby Keith and one of country's greatest artists and true outlaws, Merle Haggard. This year marks seven years since we lost Merle. Haggard passed away on his birthday, April 6th, in the year of 2016, at the age of 79 years old, after battling pneumonia. It was in the latter part of 2015, in the month of December, Merle was diagnosed with double pneumonia, which caused for Hag to cancel several concerts that were scheduled as he was hospitalized for treatment. But not long after, on February 6, 2016, legendary Merle Haggard returned to the stage. Merle made his return out in Las Vegas at the Mandalay Bay Event Center, even with his concerning health issues. This gig was particularly important to Merle as it was one of his last shows and he was determined to make sure that his band and team got paid. Again, not only was Merle struggling with his own health, but he was such a wonderful man who continued to think of and care for everyone around him. Like all things Merle did throughout his career and life, this show became another legendary moment for Haggard, as well as a successful night for his band and team. And it was all thanks to his friend, fellow country star Toby Keith. And what a very special moment it was. And according to W. Earl Brown, who was a close friend to Merle Haggard, shared the story of how this memorable night at the Mandalay Bay Events Center unfolded. Brown shared, Merle's final show, it was Super Bowl weekend. Merle had already canceled months of shows, but this particular booking was a big payday. Merle had to pay his band and crew, so there was no calling in sick for this gig. Toby Keith was in town with his wife to watch some football and have some fun. Toby got word that Merle was in Vegas, so he went to see him. Merle was in bad shape. He needed to be in a hospital, not on a stage. But the show must go on. Merle would not take charity from anyone, but he did turn to Toby and say, How many songs of mine do you know? All of them, answered Toby. Merle replied, All of them? Toby answered, yep, and I won't need a teleprompter. Merle then said, well, stay nearby. After four or five songs, Merle's infected lungs were spent. He couldn't draw enough air to sing any longer. It was announced, we've got a special guest here tonight. Toby came out and sang the rest of the show. Merle gave his last concert. The strangers got paid and the audience, while not realizing it at the time, saw something special. Brown added, Thanks to him, Merle exited the stage with his dignity intact. Wow, a moment in country music that speaks volumes about this genre. And as mentioned, this show was one of Merle's final shows. However, it was not his last. Merle's last recorded show was at the Paramount Theater in Oakland, California, back on February 13th. At a time where Toby is healing, we continue to send our prayers and love his way, and Merle Haggard will forever live in our hearts. Guys, thank you so much for tuning in here at CountryCast. If you're new, remember to hit that subscribe button down below. Turn those notifications on as well, so you never miss out on any breaking updates surrounding your favorite country artist and all the news coming right out of Music City. Y'all stay country.